Hello, today is the 4th of October and Amy's done some homework and we need to just uh, go through to say what we've done and this and never. Don't worry about that math one for a minute. I've got, I've got to quickly just finish it off in a second. I've got something I've got to do for that. Right. What? Yeah, just put that to one side, that's right. Right, so what have we done, Amy? What's this one called? Jobs I think I can do. Right, and sh show the camera so we can that's all of Amy's homework look how neat that is yeah go on in. do you want to read a couple of bits or the, or the yes. jobs you think you can do number one I can swim so maybe a lifeguard right number two filling shelves and putting stuff away like on a, in a shop yeah number three I think I could be a w Wait. waitress yeah Sla um comma bracket um, lady takes orders. Yeah. Number four, I like working with children. Good. Number five, with um, training some shop work, I had an interview at the work spot. I was little too young. Okay. Number six, I didn't want to be a cleaner, but I can do it. Yeah. Number seven, I shall at the cinema, okay. like... A hostage. Hostess, yeah. Who welcomes customers. Yeah. Number eight, party planner organiser. So we've done quite a bit, haven't we? There's quite a few jobs we can do, isn't there? <coughs> What's this one here? Oh, these are the... Right, again, show show the camera. Websites. What do we have to do? We had to go on the... Um, internet. Right. Um, find out what jobs I can do. Which are local, yeah? In Gillingham. Like, through... Um, oh, what we had to, yeah, we had to name the job sites, didn't we? What job sites there were. So show the camera again quickly. That is a job. And we found, we did find a couple of jobs on there, didn't we? What ones did we find? Um, warehouse. Operative, yeah, to pick and pack. Grocery colleague at... A.S. Bar. Asda. Oh, Asda, yeah. Asda, you've written it crap. Alright, Asda, innit? Yeah. Should we cross it out and write that one again, Asda? Just cross it out there and then write it over the top of it. Oh God! Please. We'll do it in a second anyway. Okay. A dispensing. Assistant for boots the shop. Yeah. Number six, midday midday, services. midday supervisor. Dingham Primary School. So there's a few there for your age. What we could probably do, isn't there? Yeah. Right. You right. know, next bit of homework. What is this one? What skills? Show the camera again. I am good. <coughs> Show me lovely writing. Look at that lovely neat writing. Yeah. I'll read it out. Number one, mm -hmm. I am good at shopping and counting change, yeah. which is true. Yeah. Number two, I am a strong swimmer and a good diver. Which is true, I can say that, yeah, because you do swimming and diving. Um, number three, I like bike rides and riding my bike. When we go to the riverside, That yeah. is number three. Yeah. Number four, I am the best at 110s and units. Which you are. Number five, I like cooking for heaters and spaghetti bolognese. Yeah, which is true. Number six, I am good at driving games on my Xbox. Which is true. Number six. Number yeah. seven, I am good at making people laugh. Which is which also is true. true. Number eight, I am good at saving money in my banking account. Good girl, which is Number true. Number nine, I am pretty good on computers. Yeah, you are. Which yeah. I Better am. than me. Yeah, you tell, you tell me what to do sometimes, don't you? Yeah. Right. <clears throat> Number 10. Yeah. I am a good listener mm -hmm. and can give advice and helpful. Good, yeah, it's true. Number 11. I am good at looking after small children. Yeah, Number like, 12. Yeah. I am good at being trustworthy. Okay. Number 13. I like to communicate yeah. and socialise yeah. with my friends. Good girl. Which yeah, it's true. You like communicating <coughs> and socialising, yeah. 14, I am really good at reading. Yeah, you are. Number 15, I like singing in the bath and dancing. Yeah, but they're all the things you're good at, isn't it? And that's what they ask you to do for homework. So right, all, Amy Louise Sheldon. So they're all the things you can do within work-wise is one page, and then that page is all, the thing, all your skills, all the things you think you're good at. And it's true. Every one of them is true. Alright? Yeah. And then we've done a little bit of math there and uh which yeah. I'll yeah, which we'll go through in a minute because Amy didn't bring a ruler with us, so we're gonna have to have a another little look at that in a minute. But I told you you've got to bring all your stuff next time, haven't you? Yeah, I will. What I bought for you. And by looking at the time up there, what's the time? 
It is, time is now, is, the big hand is on the nine. Uh, sorry? Yes, it is. What's the big no, hand? No, the big, <laughs> sorry, the small hand is on the nine. <coughs> and then, <coughs> 25 minutes past nine. And the time is, if I can, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, how do I turn this, uh, no, you, it doesn't come up. Oh, I can't turn it around until... Well, well, the time is... If you have a look, the time is 25 past nine. Well done. And uh, we don't have to do any homework today because we took about an hour doing that homework, didn't we, the other yeah. night? So uh, that was all our computer... I mean, we had to go on a computer, we had to look on these job sites, and we found a couple of little jobs that we kind of interested in. But again, because Amy was deemed to be a little bit too young for the works, <laughs> it's quite possible that these jobs are going to say he's too young as well <clears throat> but we're going to keep trying we're going to knock on some doors soon aren't we after christmas yeah and uh see if we can find a little bit of uh part-time work that pays you yeah like uh choppers what choppers do. yeah but we'll do something that's a little bit different this time because i don't really want to do hair and that was a bit boring it, wasn't it, it? Was yeah. bit well you let the college know that you don't want to really do hair this time because you might change your mind by now i don't know some options are maybe you want to work with children Maybe you don't want to work children, maybe you want to be a hostess. You know somebody who sits at a front desk and welcomes people in yeah. to the building and stuff and they have to, when they say I have an appointment for Mrs Brown, you have to think, all right, I'll just ring Mrs Brown for you. And then you've got to ring her up. Uh, I have a customer here for you that wants to speak to you. And then they'll say, okay, tell them I'll be down in a minute. And it's just things like that. You're like a welcome person at the desk. So you can do that. You can be like a hostess. You can be waitressing. No. No? Like going around getting orders for food and then no, coming back? No, I think that is a bit boring. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, fair enough. So, well, we've, it's an idea anyway. Yeah. All right, if times are hard and need a bit of money. So we've got waitressing, we've got working with children. What else, what else did I say at the beginning? Well, teacher. No, I didn't say teacher. I can't remember what was the first one I said, no? Shows how old I'm getting. <laughs> so... What we can do, working with children, we could do waitressing with them. Yeah, I said about, yeah, working in a shop would be okay if we can get the, if we can get to be trained up in a till, how we deal with money and stuff, that'd be good. Maybe not just ready slightly for that yet, maybe we need a, more practice with our money, yeah? Mm -hmm. And we get that real, real nail down to a T, yeah? Yeah. And we might do that next week, a bit of money, get us back into the flow of things again. Okay? Mm -hmm. But for now... We've got some ideas and stuff, so that's about it. But we've been on, like I say, we went on the internet, found a couple. Who knows? We, I think we'll, uh, we'll do all right after Christmas. All right, say goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.